Scotland is set to become a leading hydrogen nation and we are playing a vital part. We are working with energy developers to provide water to support hydrogen facilities across Scotland. But what is hydrogen and how is it created? Well here's the science. There are several types of hydrogen. The main ones are blue hydrogen, which is extracted from fossil fuels, but with carbon capture built in. Or green hydrogen, using sustainable energy to split water, which is H2O, into hydrogen and oxygen. Powered by green energy sources, wind, wave or solar. Hydrogen is most commonly found in water, whether in its raw state, in our locks and reservoirs, or even in our wastewater. Whatever the source, water is key. Without water, there is no green hydrogen. In some areas, Scotland is blessed with water and wind, which is why green hydrogen is such an exciting proposition. The potential is huge for Scotland's push to decarbonise and reach net zero. But how do you turn water into green hydrogen? Hydrogen is separated from the oxygen in water using electricity. Renewable electricity powers the electrolyzers. Accompanied by a negatively charged cathode and a positively charged anode, when water is pumped into the anode, it splits water into oxygen, hydrogen ions and electrons. The protons are then conducted to the cathode, where they then reunite with the electrons to create green hydrogen. This can then be stored as gas in a liquid fuel for use in heavy industry such as steel, glass, chemicals or to power fuel cells in vehicles. So what does this mean for Scotland? Well, with Scotland's natural water resources, this is a fantastic opportunity. Scotland has an ambition of generating 5 gigawatts of low carbon hydrogen by 2030, the equivalent of powering 1.8 million homes. We have the resources and the skills to deliver, helping Scotland achieve a clean, green and affordable energy future.